What is going on everyone? Mecca here with a brand new Hikari video. And in in this video we're we're, we're gonna be cre creating a, a simple activity. That 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 this where we're gonna first display it as a static activity and then we're gonna display it as a dynamic dynamic activity. Now what what do I mean by activity or, 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 mm, I, I, I mean by the the mm, the bot displaying a message every, every, every now and then showing that it's playing a game pretty much it's, it, 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 it's just a simple little event that, that, that we're gonna create and it's gonna be our demonstration of, of of events which goes into my second thing what is an event event is an event is is, is pretty much just a line of code that waits for a particular event which is why it's called, called, called an event to 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 run and then what to occur and then when that event occurs it it, it runs that code so while while we're doing this there, there there's going to be two mainly two 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 ways we're going to do this there's the incorrect way and then there's the correct way the i'll i'll, I'll show you why why I, I say this is the incorrect way so the first before we get started just make sure that you have import async async seal added because we're we're going to be using it in this example we're not going to use it right away but but but, but uh, i'm not gonna say that i'm adding down that we're going to need a, a async seal so 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 just pretty much have, have have that import statement added okay and so the the first thing we're going to do is we're going to do the incorrect way now it, it, I call it the incorrect way, but 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 doing it this way does still work. But it's the reason why I say it's the incorrect way because it's programming wise, it's not very optimal to 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 do it this way. Okay, and so in in our bot that run, so we're we're simply gonna do status equals, and this is a pre pre predefined parameter, so we 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 can't change the well, what it's called. So Hikari. dot status dot online and this is going to mm, define that this bot mm, this is going to be this mm, the status that that runs that shows the bot is online activity equals hikari dot activity and this requires mm, for parameters and the parameter is going to be name equals and I'm going to do this is a test Okay, and then I'll do an expression, and then we're gonna define the type, which equals Hikari dot activity type, and the activity type is gonna be playing. Now you can do mm, mm, different types of activity types. You, you can do watching. Mm, you can mm, you can do. Um, I think you can do streaming. I think I think streaming is another one. Mm, but don't don't hold hold me to 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 to, to that. <laughs> but, but just to, I just want to stress that you can do, playing is not the only one, and online is not the only one that you have access to. Okay, and so if we run this. We can see that the bot is displaying this. This is a test. Now, the the problem with this is that this is a static. Mm, this is static, meaning that that that, that this is never going to change. And, and, and second of all, it's running in our bot bot dot run, which is not programming wise. It's not the best way to go 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 about doing this. The better way would, would be to one make this type the dynamic, and, and and two to to run this in, in its own event. And so that's what, what, what we're going to do. So I'm going to delete this. And so instead, we're going to come over here. And then we're going to do, do a, a new parameter, a new like mm, handler called, called bot.listen. And so it's going to require a parameter which is hikari dot started event which means that we're waiting listening for the event to start 
an async def and this is going to be our on start event event and then we're going to pretty much do do the same thing that we did before but i'm going to define my own my own bear for variables for it so hikari dot status dot online and then i'm going to create a second one called first activity which is going to be hikari dot activity and the name is gonna be call this one. This is the first test because we're making this dynamic. And then the type equals Hikari dot activity type dot plane. Okay, and then this is where this is how we're gonna make it make it dynamic dynamic where, where, where we we need we need uh, an await called up, mm, bot update presence which which is how, how you're gonna update the presence and the status is gonna be mm, first status which is why I created by my own variables and the activity is gonna be first activity and then Mm, now I'm gonna tell it to, to 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 wait 60 seconds so so I can do do the second activity. So await asyncio dot sleep, and I'm gonna tell it to wait 60 seconds, and then I'm gonna do mm, create a, a new variable called new status, which is gonna be the same exact thing. Hikari dot status dot online. And then the new activity goes Hikari dot activity and the name equals this is the second test. And then the type equals Hikari dot activity type dot play and then we're gonna just do do the same thing as before uh, update presence oh wait bot dot update presence status equals new status and activity equals new activity okay and so now if we if we run this every 60 seconds, it will change, change to the new activity. So it's displaying, this is the first test. And then in 60 seconds, it's going to change to, this is the second test. Okay. And there, and as, as, as you can see, it, 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 it changed to, this is the second test. And so if you want access to, to, to my Discord, the link is going to be in the, the, in the description. There's not a lot going on in my Discord, but, but mm, if you want to talk, talk, talk with me or you have a, want, want me to take a look, look at your code, you, mm, mm, I, I'll, I'm, 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 pre I'm pretty active on, on the server because I'm pretty much the only one that's talking on there. <laughs> okay. And so now that that's out of the way, there's a just a little problem with this. That sure this works, but it doesn't. There there's no way to 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 tell it to go back to the first one. And we we could hard 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 code this to to do that, but there's a better way of doing this, and that's with you using a task. Uh, so pretty much a, a task is a it's an event that runs in a loop and it does it automatically so you don't have to tell it to run in a loop which is very useful for, for us now to to set up a task it's going to require a couple uh, a, a, a small a little bit of setup and so to do this we we need to add a new import statement which is going to be from it's going to be from lightbulb.ext and we're going to import tasks and then 
just above our our uh, where where we're gonna create create our task. We're gonna, we're gonna do tasks dot load. Gonna load the bot. Okay, and then we're just gonna pretty much just change up our 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 code a little bit to to to, to make it a a a task rather than than a than a than, than an event. And so for this, we we need to we, we can get rid of this, and then we're gonna change this to at tasks dot task, and we're gonna set the the the. It's gonna require how how many seconds you you want this, mm, how how many seconds you you want this mm, this task to 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 to, to, to loop for. It's gonna be seconds. God damn it. Which is gonna be equals 120, 120 seconds, and then you 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 can define if you want it to auto start, which we are gonna set it to auto start. So we're gonna set that to true, and then we're gonna mm, mm, we need to also pass the 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 app, and so it's gonna be true, and then. We're gonna change this to gonna delete this, and I'm going to change this to mm, bot status. Bot status, and we're gonna set this to bot, and then we're gonna return none. Okay, this is good, and I'll change this to what I'm actually going to be doing for, for my bot, which is since my bot is a gacha bot, <laughs> just putting something silly. And then, second one, I'm going to do debugging my code, just something silly. Okay, and that's all we need to do. All right, and so now, when when you run this, it's not gonna mm, run it mm, run the, the the status automatically, mm, and, and, and it's gonna run the second command, the second one first. Just, just keep that in mind. So we're gonna run it, and it's gonna run the loop. is gonna run every one hundred twenty seconds. So it's gonna take a bit of time to, to uh, for this to loop. Okay, and it's displaying the first one, and so it's gonna take a bit of time to show the second one. But once it mm, shows the the second one, it's gonna loop back to to the first one, and then it's gonna mm, and then we we don't have to do anything else because it's automatically gonna loop it. So it's displaying the second one, and so we just need to wait for the first one. And as you can see, it it's it it has changed to to the the second one. And so yeah, that's gonna do it for this video. As as you can see, it it, it displayed the second one, and then it switched to the first one after quite quite a bit of time. For for testing, you you may want to change change this so it's not 120 seconds to, and decrease the time. So, that that way it, it happens faster, but I'm um, I'm I'm not planning on like really mm, updating this that, that that much, so I figured I'd just leave, leave it as as the amount for, as the number that I'm gonna be using. But yeah, this that's gonna do do it for this video. So yeah, this has been Mega, and I will see you again next time.